hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel so in the today's video i will guide you how you can replicate your bucket into the different aws accounts so as you can see this is my aws account code sagar and i have created two buckets in it so if you want to uh, learn how we can create a bucket so you can go to my youtube channel so this is my youtube channel and i have created a video on how to create a s3 bucket and give it a public access so from that video you can create a bucket so i have this account and i have a different account aws account first we have to create a bucket in this account so let's create a bucket bucket name i have selected acl disabled recommended so i have unticked the block access click on acknowledge so for the replication we have to enable versioning on both the buckets so make sure that you have enabled versioning in source and the destination bucket and create bucket so let's verify if the versioning is enabled in this account also so you can go to properties so as you can see versioning is enabled so bucket is created successfully so i want to replicate my source bucket into the destination bucket in a different account so first you have to go to the source bucket and click on management and you have to create a replication rule so you can name it replicate in second account so scroll down so select apply to all the objects in the bucket so here you have to select a specify a bucket in another account so you have to enter the account id of different account so this is the account id copy this id and paste it and you have to enter the bucket name which we have created in into the second bucket so you can copy the bucket name and paste it so as you can see this is in the us east region scroll down so next you have to create a ima role so we are creating a new role scroll down and save this replication role so this is asking if you want to replicate the existing objects so i don't have any objects in the bucket so if you uh, have objects in your bucket so you can select yes this will create a batch operation for s3 bucket so you can uh, select yes also if you have requirement so click on submit so we have created a replication rule so this is for the source bucket so now we have to go to the uh, destination bucket into the different account and we have to enable some permissions so just go to the permissions tab and we have to add a bucket policy here so you can uh, copy the bucket policy from the official website also so i will put this website's link into the description also so you have to uh, just copy this policy and in the bucket policy click on edit and paste it here so you have to change some uh, parameters so this is for the objects permission we can give it id 1 and this is for the bucket permissions we can give it id 2 so you have to change the principal aws arn so this is the arn of role which we have created for the source bucket account so just go to the uh, bucket and click on management and click on replication role so here you can see we uh, this is the role for the replication so click on it so 
so as you can see this is the uh, role for source bucket code sagar so just copy the arn and paste it here and you have to replace in the bucket policy as well so replace and uh, after that you have to enter the bucket name of destination so just copy the bucket name and change it here just replace the bucket name and we are done so in this policy we have uh, changed principal arn and the bucket name so after that you can save this policy and we are done so let's verify if the application is working so just go to the uh, source bucket account and upload a new file in the source bucket so let's upload a file just go to the folder and select one file drag drop it and upload the file so our file is uploaded so we have uploaded a file into the source bucket so let's see if the file is replicated into the destination bucket refresh it so this will take some time to replicate so as you can see the file is replicated into the destination bucket also so in this way we can replicate a source bucket into the destination bucket with different aws accounts so hope you like this video so if you have any query so you can comment below and i would love to reply don't forget to like and subscribe to my youtube channel thanks for watching